really, really wasn't no pressure. Um, high, emotions were high. Uh, really couldn't wait all, all of our freshmen uh, just to get out here and get our first uh, game under in the semi hot under our belt. So it felt real good. Uh, Jeff, Romeo, just your thoughts on the way uh, Rob was playing, especially just the calmness and running the show. Uh, I felt like Rob played real well. Uh, he didn't play like a freshman. Freshman guard first first game in the semi hall. Um, uh, he, he showed that he showed that he can pass the ball and everything he's capable of doing. Um, he basically translated his game from high school into college. Well, off this game, pretty pretty well. What took you missed for you to get that first basket? How much were you just looking to pass first and then the first eight or ten minutes of the game? Uh, I just uh, my my job is to attack, and I I was just attacking, and people were getting on me, and I left my teammates open, so I was just making the right basketball play and letting the game come to me. Questions for Evan. Um, I say that's definitely an area that we we need to improve in. Um, and Coach talked about that after the game. Um, you know, I think I think we could do a lot better defensively, be tougher. Uh, they ran some stuff that we haven't seen before, so uh, we got to do a better job of adjusting to that. Yeah, coach has talked a lot about how, you know, he wants us to be a team that shares the ball um, with one another. And, you know, that's, I think that's how you win games is sharing the ball, finding the open man, uh, keep everyone happy. And, you know, like you said, I was a beneficiary of that tonight. And uh, we'll see. Hopefully we can continue to share the ball moving forward. That was nice. Yeah, a great pass. Um, yeah, I mean, he... Uh, he, I didn't even see him look at me, to, to be honest. So I don't, I don't know how he saw me, really. But he found me somehow and finished the layup. I guess that jumper. I <laughs> <laughs> finally see the ball go through the net. That's all I really need. I just, I just need to see that first shot go down. Then it's all good for me from there. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, I'm not really used to freshmen coming in and being that tough and ready to go mentally. Um, you know, physically, I think he can definitely hold his own. He's shown that in our scrimmages and tonight again. So um, if he can continue that, it's going to help us a lot. Uh, really, my trainers before I got here, um, Got here uh, like in June, and then also just the preparation from the coaching staff from June all the way until preseason. Uh, I'm sure you've been in games like this where you're you know, up comfortably uh, in kind of the game's not competitive in the second half. What can you still get out of those situations uh, in a game like this? Um, I think one of the big things is guys that might not usually play as much, they get. Uh, quality minutes, and that could be big for our team moving forward just because you never know when you're going to get your chance to get out there. So um, it's good for guys that don't play as much to get experience. And um, you want to try to not get complacent at any point. So just keep keep pushing it like we did. Go ahead and use the microphone, Steve. Uh, just for either of you guys, Devontae had 15 points off the bench tonight, obviously finally healthy. What difference did he make You know, on both ends of the court, really? Uh, he made a big difference um, just to be able to come off the bench and um, have that experience from last year uh, to back up, back up Rob tonight. And uh, we really, uh, in the scrimmage we played, uh, we kind of missed his presence, just having a backup guard with experience like that. And um, I felt like he played real well both, both on defense and, and offense, getting uh, people open shots. Romeo, you were able to get to, the, to your spots pretty easily tonight, get to the basket. Was there something about their defense or maybe something about y'all's offensive scheme that allowed you to do that? Uh, yeah, uh, we worked on a lot this this week in practice on, on the advance pass, and uh, I felt like uh, that's what I was I was getting the ball mainly on advance passes, and the defense wasn't set, so I just had to open the court even more for me to go do the things I'm best at. Romeo saw uh, Devontae and Rob playing together for a little bit tonight. How do they kind of complement each other, and what might allow them to maybe you know share some minutes on the court together, you know, moving forward? Uh, uh, Devontae, he's a he's a real good he's a real good scorer as well as a passer, but I felt like scoring is his is his main thing, and Rob can pass the ball really well. So just letting Devontae play without the ball 
for a little bit when they're both in the game at the same time. It opens the cut up even more for guys like me and Evan and uh, J-Mo.